Great Commission, Jesus tells his disciples, as you go, make disciples of every nation, teaching them to obey everything that I have commanded you and know that I will be with you even to the end of the age. He spoke these words in Galilee. But let's listen to an account in the book of Acts of what Jesus said on what the church now calls the Ascension outside Jerusalem. So when they'd come together, they asked him, Lord, will you at this time restore the kingdom to Israel? He said to them, it's not for you to know times or seasons that the Father has fixed by his own authority, but you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes upon you and you will be my witnesses in Judea, in Samaria, and even to the ends of the earth. And lo, I am with you, even to the end of the age. It's not unlikely that the disciples left Jerusalem and went back to Galilee after the crucifixion and the resurrection, not really knowing what to do next or what was ahead of them. Neither it is, is it unlikely that as devout Jews, they returned to the capital for the next festival. They'd been celebrating with Jesus the festival of Passover, and now they come to Jerusalem in a totally different situation, still reeling from the grief of Jesus' death and the amazement, wonder and joy of his resurrection. And they come to celebrate Pentecost. And there are appearances here of the risen Jesus to them as well. But whereas up in Galilee, he says, as you go, here in Jerusalem, he says to them, stay, stay, wait until you receive power from on high. The commission to make disciples comes to us all through baptism, through confirmation, through the message of the church down the ages since the great commission of Jesus. But the power to fulfil it comes afresh to each one of us as we open our hearts and lives to the love of God in the power of Jesus. What the first disciples experienced at that first Pentecost is open for all of us now. And in these times, thy kingdom come times, between the time when we remember his ascension to the time when we will celebrate afresh the coming of the Holy Spirit at Pentecost, we are called to ready ourselves afresh, to receive the anointing of the Holy Spirit, to in our day share Jesus' love, to make disciples of all nations and to be his witnesses, here not in Judea or in Samaria, but here in St David's Diocese in Wales in your village, in your town, in your city.